Okay, I'm making this little video about this journal, altered book, that I made for my daughter. There's an M here for Mariah, or maybe it's murder. I don't know. Anyway, Mariah, would you untie those ribbons? This used to be an old stupid book, and I pulled the guts out of it. And I've added this really nasty looking bedding all around. I'm trying to untie it. It's hard because I've got my sunglasses on. Uh, I can't see what I'm doing. Well, do you want to hold the camera for a minute while I do it? Oh, okay, you got that going. Okay. I've got the, the skulls, or skeletons ribbon, and the regular ribbon. Okay, now. You can hold on to it. We've got this little skull. It's metal. And this opens out. And oops, here is zero. zero. He's got a flap inside so you can write in him. Of course you can write on his backside. He's got a leash so he can't take off and go away. You know how little ghost dogs get lost. Let me help you put him in here. Now there's also inside of the Sally. Sally. She's got this purple thing in the way of her face. There's her whole face. Okay. And then you look on the back and you can journal on there. And she's tied to something by this purpley sequined ribbon. <laughs> and it's Jack. Yay. And you can also journal on the back of him while we're looking in uh, some silver mirror tape. <laughs> so we can see what we're saying about stuff. And keep an eye on what the, who's behind you in the mirror while you type when you write. Okay, now we can tuck this in there. And there we go with that part. Now there's some pockets with just some notes and tags that you can write on. On the front of each of these um, signatures, which I have stitched in in a really r outrageous fashion because the inside of the binding has a secret. I'll show that in a minute. Okay, so we've got hand stitched in pages and we've got a tuck spot for, s for some journaling and stickers. Now here's some more ribbon. And we'll just flop that over there for a minute. Okay, so there's more tucks, pockets, more journaling pages. You can write or draw or make stickers. Okay, I made this wire coil that's fastened into ribbon. It, it is removable. And these pumpkin doilies attach together to make a little notebook. Okay, more of the same here with the journal pages. And we have a spooky tree with some actual Spanish moss. Can you hold that open for me, Mariah? This part here? Because under the tree is a little doily pad just tied together with some string and placed behind the mountain and in front of the moon. Okay, let's see. We've got more of the same here. There's plenty of room for writing, drawing, making collages, whatever you like to do. And let me move that out of the way for a minute. Okay, on the back of this one, I went with purple napkin. So there's actually four pages. And there's some stickers and another little pad of paper made with a sticker on the front. Now this back part, uh-oh, it looks like it came loose. We'll have to re-glue that. There's a little door you can open, and there's a place where you can put your own photographs inside. And how the heck did that get there? That is not part of it. This is not part of it either. Okay, so we got windows on a little house, 
and the roof has all got distress ink on it. And if we lift the house out this way, and there's a tab to pull that you can add your photographs to this wherever you want them to be. And slide it back in. <laughs> I can't do it with one hand. Anyway, so then we've got this, you know, the purple swirly thing right here. And there's another pad of paper with doily. And there's a doily hill back here, and there's a moon. Okay, I'm going to just have to re glue that little door in place because it came off. Anyway, so there's all that netting in the back, too. And now let's fold this all together for a second and see that on the very top there's a secret hiding place in here. And if you pull on the purple ribbon. There's a little sliding device. Is it not sliding very well? I might need a, a bit of tugging. I'm not going to break it. Well, there we go. It's, it's loose enough. There's a pen in it right now, but there's you can put plenty of things. And there's a magnet, which ended up not really being needed, but it tucks back down inside of there. And we put all the ribbons mm -hmm. over top. And when we tie it shut, these are for whatever wants to go with it. And it's pretty bulky. Oh, I can hardly hold it with one hand. Okay, that is the Nightmare Before Christmas journal for my purple-haired daughter. Yay! <laughs> That's it. And like I always say, keep making stuff, I mean it. Yeah.